what's going on everybody so I'm right here at Edmonton's worst intersection so if any of you are living in Edmonton and you're watching this video you may have seen some articles released earlier this week which describe the 20 worst intersections in the city now we're not talking worst intersections as in collisions or danger or anything we're talking the worst intersections for traffic delays now this is one of two intersections in the city that got an F grade for both the morning and the evening rush hours, which means that the delays here are longer than 80 seconds. So what I'm doing here today is that I'm going to see how long this light is going to be red for. Now the problem with this intersection and much of 111th Street in general is the LRT line running in the median down the avenue. So if you're trying to turn left like I am right now, or if you're trying to cross 111th Street, sometimes there are very severe delays due to the trains and the poor signaling around here. So, let's just see how long this takes. Well now traffic to the right that's going straight across 111th Street has gotten the green light, but the delays are definitely worse if you're turning left, as I know from experience. Okay, their light went red. Maybe ours will go green? Ah, uh, nope. So you think it might go green, but it never does. You're sitting here for a very long time. This is also about the worst time to come to this intersection too. It's about, as you can probably see in the timestamp, it's just before 6 o'clock in the evening. So we're about, we're about around evening rush hour, probably a little after the peak, but yes, this would be one of the worst times for traffic as well. There we go. Took long enough. Well, I'm back at Edmonton's worst intersection, just from a different angle this time. It's about 20 to 5, so we're getting into rush hours, so I'm probably going to be waiting here a while. <laughs> Oh dear, no wonder this is the worst intersection in the city. Thank the Lord Almighty. I have to say, I'm really glad that this intersection is not a part of my daily commute. If it was, I would go crazy. Or I'd probably just take a different route altogether. <laughs> 